I call him Mo. He also goes by Maury, but he doesn't really like that too much. We always got along, you know, we played instruments together, it, you know, because we were only two and a half years apart, you know, we were very close growing up. And he always, he was always caring. He always um, wanted to help people. And I did manage to speak to him before he died when they did a head scan on him. They found a, an eight centimeter brain tumor. I came to the idea of like, I think this is what my brother would want. So I, I offered my brother to them. We described the study to the family. They immediately felt that, you know, this is what their loved one would have wanted to do. And um, so instead of donating organs, um, the individual donated their body for the purpose of testing a genetically edited pig kidney. As far as the medical team, they are phenomenal. And I hope there's a way that Mary and I could pay them back for their gratitude. You know, they've been very, very good. I'm in awe of someone who can make a decision like that at, you know, one of the worst moments in their lives and really think about other people and think about humanity. Um, and so I was very touched by that, and you know, it's a very emotional experience. And then this is a more recent picture of my brother. It's probably within the last uh, six, eight years or so. Um, this was his cat, Charlie. And uh, again, the kind of person that he was. Um, he loved uh, animals. He always had dogs and cats. I'm glad my brother can be a part of it, this groundbreaking research. And this, the, the, the tragic death, the, the fast, short um, death, something good has come out of it. It was the decedent's birthday in the middle of the monitoring period. We discussed with the family if they would like us to have a celebration of the decedent's life and an acknowledgement of the gift that he was continuing to make to society and to future people that require transplantation. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mo. Thank you, Mo. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. They, they went all out. They decorated happy birthday balloons and they sang to him. It was just touching. I have been adamant about never donating anything. It opened both my wife and I's eyes both in the trant, the donor thing, where I might just, next time my license is up, just check that box. Because it's so important. Part of it is for Mo's legacy, and the other part is just, you know, we can't move forward without doing something like this. You know, we have to start somewhere. And, and you know, and I think, like I said, my brother would have wanted something like this. Because I don't. He's living, leaving a huge legacy behind. He really honestly is. And it's so encouraging. It's very encouraging to a lot of people. Glad that you did.